Johannesburg is, uh, is the biggest uh, monument area in, in Gauteng. Uh, in terms of the, of the numbers of uh, inmates uh, and in terms of the officials um, in Gauteng. Um, we have over 10,000 uh, inmates in Gauteng. Uh, so you can just imagine uh, the, the pressure that we, we, are, we, are, we, we have. We are launching the telematics schools project and also celebrating Women's Month. So in terms of the telematics schools project, we have partnered with the Department of Basic Education and Basic Education also partnered with Stellenbosch and also in Talsat. So we do have female learners in our schools. We have a school in Bavianspurt where this telematics have been piloted. That is at Anton Jenny School and now here we are launching it because we did not have an opportunity to launch it. But basically the purpose of this telematics is that it is rendering our support to our learners and also our educators. It renders the support to our learners so learners can be able to access all the educational sessions. It's through videos, it's through PowerPoint, through the telematics project. So in cases where we have lack of resources, especially in terms of teachers, the telematics school project offers all the subjects. So the, our teachers, our educators will be able to download all the subjects and learners will be able to access that and in their own time, they can still be able to do their revision and they will be moving, it will be rolled out to other correctional centres. It's not only for female offenders, so all our offenders in all our schools, they will be able to access this uh, telematics school project. We are in Talset, we are a global um, space and satellite telecommunications. We've been operating for 60 years. We are everywhere, we provide connectivity, unlimited connectivity in spaces where there is no connectivity, in spaces where it's unreachable. So definitely we do offer sustainable connectivity throughout the continent, in Europe, in Africa, in the Middle East, in Asia as well. So definitely we believe that, you know, to bridge the digital divide, it is very key for our company. The role of UNISA today is to support the education and rehabilitation program because this is at the uh, school's level. We as higher education, we are here mandated by what the white paper is saying on supporting the basic right to education. And you cannot support only higher education and leaving basic education behind. So our mandate, as we are the trainers of teachers, we are also looking forward to seeing to the world that 4IR and 5IR is here to stay. And we are also looking at taking it to a higher level where we are going to incorporate the AI, artificial intelligence, and ensuring that there are also robotics at school level. So we cannot ignore the offender learner and focus on the learners outside, but we must also have a holistic and a global view of what constitutes a change in society. So we are very excited as the University of South Africa supporting our partners, being Stellenbosch University and Telemasts, because we know that together in education, we are going to achieve a lot. I'm here today to launch the Telematic Schools Project, which is a joint initiative between the Stellenbosch University and the Western Cape Education Department. Today we partnered with Intelsat, Global Sales and Marketing, Department of Basic Education, and the Department of Correctional Services to bring telematics to our inmates here at the Ladies Correctional Services. Today we are launching the telematics program which is going to assist us as educators and the learners. This program is going to make our work to be easier because in this program there are workbooks that we're going to use. Even if we don't watch it uh, lively, we're going to still gonna have uh, recordings which we're going to use it later. Like for, for example, if a learner doesn't understand a certain topic, the teacher can take a recording and then the teacher will explain the recording in the classroom, going through with the recording with the learners. 
So it's going to help us very much with the revision as we are going to start with our final exams very soon, October, November. I feel it's going to be very much beneficial to us because at, at the moment we struggle a lot with content when it comes to studying. So it will really help us um, with getting our work done properly and so it will really help us a lot because it will inform us. I would love to study law when I'm done with my metric. So hopefully this will help a lot towards the path that I want to take in future.